In today's lecture, we'll see how to write a C program to find area of square, rectangle, and circle. So here I'm starting my program with a comment. On the next line, we have to include the preprocessor directive. So hash include is a preprocessor directive, which is including standard input output header file. On the next line, I'm defining the real constant. The name of the real constant is pi. And the value of this real constant is 3.14. In the previous lectures, we have already seen how to define real constants. The link of those videos is provided in the description box. So for defining real constants, there are two ways. First is by making use of hash defined preprocessor directive. Another is by making use of const keyword. Then here comes the main function. The return type of main function is int, that is integer. So we will be ending this main function by using return zero statement. Inside main function, I am declaring a few variables. So the first variable is side, second variable is length, third variable is breadth, and the last variable is radius. We'll be starting with calculating the area of a square. So on the output window, the first line which will be printed is going to be this, that is area of square. Now, as we know that the formula for calculating area of square is side square, that is side into side. Here we are asking the user to enter the value for side of a square. On the next line, we are accepting the value by making use of scanf function. So inside scanf function, the format string is person D. Person D is used for integer variable. As we know that side is an integer variable, we have to use person D here, comma, ampersand, and the name of the variable. After scanning the value of variable side, here on the next line, I am calculating the area of square, that is by using the formula side into side and printing it. So on the output window, we can see area of a square is and the corresponding value. Then here we are again making use of a printf function for printing this line, that is area of rectangle. As you can see here, I'm making use of backslash n twice. So it will be leaving two lines and printing this. The formula for calculating area of rectangle is length into breadth. So we will be asking the user to enter the values for length and breadth. By making use of scanf function, I am accepting both the values at the same time. So for that, we have to make use of person d twice as both the variables are of type integer. Then by making use of ampersand, I'll be just putting the names of the variables and we'll be separating them by making use of a comma. Here on the next line, I am calculating the area of rectangle. That is by using the formula length into breadth and we are printing the value. So it will be showing area of a rectangle is and the corresponding value on the output window. Finally, we are calculating the area of a circle. So first of all, it will be showing this line on the output window. As we can see here, I'm making use of backslash n twice. So it will be leaving two lines and printing it. The formula for calculating area of a circle is pi into r square. That is pi into radius into radius. For that, we have to ask the user to enter the value for radius of a circle. By using scanf function, we are accepting the value of a radius variable. And here we are calculating the value of area of a circle and printing it. Now we can see here, I'm making use of percent %f format string. Percent %f is used for real constants or floating point constants. Whereas this point two denotes two digits after the decimal point. So after completing the program, we have to save it. I have already saved this program with the name area dot c denotes is a c program file now let's go to execute option for compiling the code as we can see here this code has zero errors zero warnings let's run the program so as we can see here on the output window the first line which is getting printed is this that is area of square now it is asking me to enter the value for side of a square so I can enter any integer value, let's say five. This is the value for area of a square, which is 25. 
on the next line we can see area of rectangle is getting printed then it is asking me to enter the values for length and breadth let's say the values are 7 and 8 so here we get the area of a rectangle that is 56 then on the next line it is printing area of circle where it is asking me to enter the value for radius of a circle let's say the value is 9 and this is the answer for area of a circle that is 254.34 now let's try to change the value of this from 2 let's make it 3 after making the change I will save the code let's go to execute and compile the code first this code has again zero errors zero warnings I can go back to execute and run the code now these things will remain as is so I'm simply providing some random values for radius of a circle I'll enter 9 and here we can see that after decimal point it is printing three digits so this is how to write a C program to find area of square, rectangle and circle. In the next lecture, we'll see how to write a C program for calculating percentage of five subjects. Thank you.